Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we're playing Crusader Kings 2 Jade Biz, episode 122. And I gotta cite my disappointment in this guy. He naturally lineally married some random person with a single claim, and for some reason, now his, my, his wing of my dynasty is dead. You've got to be kidding me. You're a king. You had no siblings. It was not like you were the third in line. You just sucked. There's part of me that says just plot to kill them all and make him have to rearrange. But I don't really care that much. I'll just settle it some other way. Um... We're letting time run. We we ended some schemes and imprisoned a person or two. People are leaving defensive packs, which is fascinating. As always, I just booted up. The Emir of Socotra. Where is Socotra? I don't think so. We're hunting for herbs, we're making theorem papers, we're, we're trying to get magnum opuses done. King of Norgar I don't care about, King of ja Gaijum. I actually don't have any good CBs against him. That's unfortunate. Emperor Thierry is known to frequent this railing. He might go splat. I would love him to go splat. Oh, we have a debate going on. Sheik Sadiq. Sheik Sadiq, the homosexual Musalit. 27 learning. Yeah, I bet he won. After several days of long discussions and much debating, the grand debate is over for now. There might have been a few heated arguments, but I think most attenders would agree that this was a, a learned thing. So, uh, that's pretty good. Final guest left, leaving peace and quiet behind. I feel like I learned a few things. It should be like learning plus one, shouldn't it? Come on, who else is going to drop out? Nobody. Inherited the Duchy of Akia. This has been going on for a while. Well, now he knows I'm trying to kill him still. <laughs> it's like, whatever you do, man. Waited a day to make that revolt gone. Sure, Antonia. I'm now over my vassal limit because I control this. You're Lord Mayor, huh? I could instantly make you a, uh,. Vassal Republic, but that would be stupid, because I have two of them in the neighborhood. You're some kid. You're matrilineally married to some dude who doesn't matter. You're matrilineally married to some dude who doesn't matter. Okay. Five, nine, nine. 1013. It's the same person. So this is the only one that's held by a different person. Just out of curiosity. I can send my lover off. Or my bastard off. Or my apprentice off. Don't have any daughters I can engage him to. That's unfortunate. I was just thinking of ways to bring more land under my control. I'll grant you the vice royalty for now, because we'll keep doing this. I I hate to tell you, dude. But you really belong under this guy. <laughs> like seriously belong under him. 
King of Nubia, but I have a truce with him, don't I? He, they're joining up anyway. I want France to die! I want his emperor to die! We gain double ingredients. I have a paper, I will send it out at once. One endorsement, two endorsement, three endorsement, I think I'm good. Four endorsement, five endorsement. While I'm certainly a great scholar with several fine discoveries to my name, I'm not too proud to collaborate with like-minded colleagues. I've contemplated hosting some of my colleagues in the Hermetic Society. Well, we're gonna spend a lot of money for this, but sure. I was planning to build another stack of retinue. The preparations have been completed and the invitation has been sent and accepted. My honored guests are going to come through. I could try going to Alexandria. How much more esoteric knowledge do I need? 200. So we're gonna do the that scroll and Akershush because it's cheap and because it's well, it's just gonna give me enough what I need to do what I want to do. I can invent a war machine, I can invent something to improve prosperity, or I can do something with a scholarly focus. I think economic is where I want to go. I look around the table and notice the displeased expression of Neophyte Pascalis. Our eyes lock a few seconds and he stands up. Really, Prosperity? I'm sorry to say, but it just seems unoriginal. Alright, Neophyte, you missed up. His suggestion is born out of spite and an unfounded sense of self importance. He's forced to concede. And I just gain a free hundred esoteric knowledge. And Thierry will soon die again. <laughs> I hope. <sighs> Success! Enough peers have endorsed my paper and so the order is accepted into the library. I gained 75 prestige and 100 esoteric knowledge and 2 learning for a while. Oh, I'm overlooking an important fact of my plan, aren't I? This was in revolt and I could have taken it. What are you? You're one province miner? You're tribal? So I won't even have to build a castle, so if I just declare holy war on your dumbass, the council will say no because they suck. Thirty councils that are bad that could be be replaced. She's sick of that. Sclerus is not a sick of He's also not the best one around. Cut me some taxes. This prince, he shall be proud of his heritage. I want to do it over here where there's sort of chaos and I can organize an actual kingdom. No, I'm taking Burgundy. This would just be a place to summon Burgundy. And if I want to have a place to summon Burgundy, I'd rather be this far out. Uh-huh. Holy War. Everyone will join. Nobody will care. Hi, kitten. My kitty just crawled up on my back. Troop count. Supplies. I might go to Winter soon. 
Hi, baby. You want to sit in the chair with me? Oh, you're so snuggly lately. I wonder why. It's because daddy's home more often because he doesn't have a real job. Yeah, that would be a thing. All right, so Mancia, let's take it. Summon up Al Jazeera just as reinforcements, just in case, but it's not going to be a problem. Ah, oh, they keep failing. As I entered the laboratory one morning, I am met by agitated voices and text messages. Hold on. Yes, I. I you keep this tutoring service that I, I'm with keeps trying to send me like 30 miles away crossing bridges and doing all sorts of stuff and it's it's, it's just not gonna work like I can't do that so anyway as I entered the laboratory one morning I met by agitated voices neophyte bag guitar and neophyte Etrice are gesturing wildly over a set of sketches they're disagreeing on the direction of the project do you want to go stick with sorry do you want to go riskier but more innovative Risky! Let's do it. We're suffering some defeats because of. I need a spy master. I could have a loyalist for the same amount of stuff. Who's also a master schemer. Yes! Come on, my council. Protect me. I'm trying to focus on my working, but it's becoming increasingly difficult. Neophyte Bagatar, and Neophyte will never grant anything. Let's be friends. Surely this thing between you is a misunderstanding. Let's not suck. The violent reaction, f my angry outburst suddenly did. So I got pissed. And they like me for getting pissed, apparently. Uh, I don't care about that. You know what? Since we've got commanders in our empire. Technically, need more commanders in my empire. It looks like. Also, don't have a court physician, so I'm gonna fix that real fast. Or a court tutor. This chick. She's got decent stats overall. Maybe nothing high, but nothing low. Yep, that works. I'm surprised I have an organizer in this army and it's still taking forever to get away. The bribe we offered the priest of Akershus was enough to make him unlock the inner chambers of the church. We examined every nook and cranny for cruels of the scrolls hiding place. On the fifth day, one of the servants announced he had found a hidden chamber. We found a hermetic text. We gained esoteric knowledge. We are now capable of writing a magnum opus. Scheduled at my writing desk, secluded at my writing desk, quill in hand, and plenty of bottle ink nearby. I find myself staring down upon the blank parchment. The sheer scale of the task about upon which I'm about to embark dawns upon me. I need to record my knowledge, but also hide it from those who are unworthy. Monthly prestige. Together, my colleagues and I have constructed a huge firm. So I'm basically writing a magnum opus. I wrote a theory paper. Had a debate. Brought my guys. And what do you even call it? Like I brought people together and had another debate, sort of. We're building a, a, a thing. Like a giant new technology for industry. And I'm writing a magnum opus about it. That's, that's pretty nuts in all honesty. Uh, we had an advanced blast furnace. So, okay, let's see what we got. Together, my colleagues and I have constructed a huge furnace of truly ingenious design. It can produce metals and steams so steady and vast that no other method can hope to rival it. This efficient new invention will make sure we have training goods and building materials of the highest quality. So we gain build time modifier, build cost modifier. I don't have anything new I could build. Uh, local tax modifier, 10%. 50 economic tech points, and I gain 200 technology. 
and now I'm writing a, a thing, a magnum opus. So a blast furnace, and it expires in a hundred years. Yo, 10% tax modifier for a hundred years on my capital. I will just build that because it's cheap. Hmm. Yeah, you notice I'm not building the piety buildings, like, at all. So I need an expanded sick house, and a pilgrim's inn. No, because I need an expanded sick house, then I need this stuff. So I'll invest in that. I don't really want to spend my money. Okay, uh, the Kingdom of Venice is no longer considered the jure part of Italia. Hi, oh. Hi, baby. You want to sit in Daddy's lap? You can sit in Daddy's lap. Come here. No, you want to sit in um, Daddy's back pillow? That's great. Laodicea prospers. Siege defeats, defeats, defeats. We won the battle, we killed 1,000. And now we full occupy him. I can't upgrade that to a castle. Mr. Whittlesbach. Grant landed title. County of Mancia. It's like, congratulations, you've got random baron, you know, tribal holding, right? You're not really the right religion, so you'll convert. Because for now, at least, that makes sense. I can upgrade his stuff for free, so. Basically, for free means prestige. I don't mind upgrading people's prestige stuff. That's how you're supposed to handle tribal vassals. Just build prestige stuff for them. Like this random scrub. Well, he's building something already. This random scrub. Like, I can build him a. Well, reinforced hill fort costs money. Yeah, sure, I'll spend 600 prestige on that. Why not? 10,000 is all I need. And that brings us to the end of this episode. If you enjoyed this series, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It really does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can make more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And as always on this channel, La Paz.